one. I'm going to show you how to fit a shock absorber on a mini 2010 plate. The R55 and R56 are basically the same. Um, just to save you a bit of money, instead of going to the garage, all you need is a few tools which you could easily buy for the price of probably the work and if you have got time, spare a bit of an hour or two, you should be able to do this to save yourself some money. Right, I'll we'll crack on now. You're gonna have to buy one of these. Really I'll do the springs, compress the springs, otherwise, you can't do it. So you're gonna need that. Alright, 21 mil you need.
Sophie's going to make me a cup of tea. Turn around, so it was a mistake, right? Why? Why don't they do that? Probably you can't, they can't do that. Also, yeah, because I confirmed it. And also, I need to count to the seconds, otherwise, I might say, well, you get two, so. Yeah, and then they can use it as an excuse. Yeah. Yeah, do that. Then. I wonder why it's gone up so much, and it was like that for one day. Yeah. Yeah. I found the ESTAs as well. Yeah. So I can get it out. I can't find the top in the winter. I can even bring them. Yeah. Or leave it. Bring who? Tesco's travel insurance. So what, what's wrong with it? Why can't you find it? I can't find the policy number. Yeah, probably worked around here. Yeah. yeah. And then they'd give it to you again, wouldn't they? Is it?
Nej. Just done it basically exactly how it came off. No springs went on the top like that, did they? Yeah, it must have done. I thought they went underneath. Like that. Oh, I see. Right, that's all on. Put the old spring compressors on this. That's the new shock. Um, this is the best way of doing it, really. Just get a, like a pry bar, make this a bit wider. This bit, and then obviously that's on there like that. Then we we'll tighten that up, and uh, we'll whack it back into this holder. Here. Same. Yeah. It's exactly the same. That's well good. Yeah. I never knew that though. Yeah. Well, I'm sure you said that one was a uh, Peugeot engine. That, this is it? Peugeot, yeah. So I wonder what the link is with bloody BMW and Peugeot then. God knows. Because I used to, used to hear people ranting about these when they first got out these diesels, how good they were. Should be BMW yeah. yeah. Definitely.
What? I need that. There you go guys, hope this helps, um, thanks for watching and if you like it can you like and subscribe because obviously it helps my channel and uh, well I might even, if I get up to 500 subscribers I might actually do a giveaway, anyway see you later, bye.